The apparatus in the figure below was set up to measure the time taken for 20 cm cubed of sodium thiosulfate to react with 5 cm cubed of hydrochloric acid in a 100 cm cubed conical flask at 20 degrees C. The timer was started when the sodium thiosulfate was added to the flask. The timer was stopped when it was no longer possible to see the cross on the paper. And you can see here is the experimenter looking down through the conical flask at where the cross was marked on a piece of paper. The reaction mixture is in here. This is a reaction that produces a precipitate of sulfur and that obscures the cross so it doesn't really disappear but we can't see it, which is likely to decrease the accuracy of the experiment. Rinsing the flask with acid before each new experiment. Well, this is actually the answer, because since acid is one of the reactants, introducing extra acid at the start of each experiment will mean there's more acid in the flask and the sodium thiosulfate will therefore react faster. So A is correct.